Hi and welcome back to Happening TV. Um, today I want to talk about a, a post I posted about a, a couple days ago. Um, I want to talk about that. Um, as you know, if you don't know by now, it's the 2024 football season coming up. Uh, Arizona is not a new conference. Um, you can see on the right here they have the they're the Big 12 now. So um, I want to talk about this a little bit um, since they were doing some field changes. Um, try and want to capitalize on it um i think the field could still look better it looks nice looks nice with the red and blue of course i love it but um i feel like it could it could we can kind of bring this up again i brought it up in the past but um just want to see if here they can uh, bring a wildcat here just bring a wildcat over here so it kind of looks balanced you have like your four corners taken care of you have your center there um, I'm happy with the end zones. I'm, I'm keeping them the same. Uh, keeping them the same um, look on each side is is great. Um, I would have liked to switch like red and blue for this one, but it's okay. Um, we're gonna, we're gonna leave it alone um, for this time. Um, it the field's just almost done. It just needs a couple of touch ups. I feel, and uh, we're gonna go ahead and show my what I'm talking about here. But that's what they have right now. That's what they're gonna, you know, currently play with right now. And this is what I added to it. Um, so I went ahead and I did actually did the Big 12 logos a little bit better, a little bit bigger, excuse me, <laughs> and um, better too. But um, see how right here it's like they're afraid to put them on. It's like they're all small. They're kind of afraid to put them. Like okay, I guess we're kind of in the Big 12. Yes, we are in the Big 12. And of course we added the Wilbur here. Um, I like the Wilbur that has the goatee right here. There's a there's a Wilbur that doesn't have it, and that's fine too if they put decide to put that one. But I like going with the goatee, especially for football. Um, and then we went ahead and added color on the on the benches here too. So um, to make it, it just pops more. I was gonna leave this the benches plain, but I thought, well, if this is just hash like that, that could use color. That's kind of you know boring like that. And then back here, there's nothing. It's just all grass. So I went ahead and kind of, um, you could do, you could swap them. You can do blue and red here, but I decided to go with blue because you have the red on the borders here already. So it kind of gives it a break and it leaves the red on the outside for everything. Um, so I went ahead and did that. And, um, but yeah, I think this is a better, a better, a better look. It looks more, looks more professional. It looks more like more done, more complete. Um, just something minor to consider. I think it's just, uh, you know, as far as details go. Um, so yeah, I would add color on the benches and of course you have to put Wilbur here and I went with the white and blue, um, Wilbur because since the borders outside borders here are red already, um, and then the big 12 logos are red. So, you know, I decided to go with the, with the white and the blue and then, um, and then again with the benches. I think that that makes it look complete right there and this is actually an actual overhead shot of the football field um thank you for whoever this is actual well this is the original image right here so whoever did that the drone whoever did that i appreciate that um the bear down i'm glad they moved that to the sidelines here um having it across the field like that it looked nice but um you know it could be i don't know maybe a little bit too much this looks more this looks cleaner more complete and uh, more professional um so yeah you guys can let me know your opinion on what field you guys think looks better uh that one there a little bit plain on the outside there the big 12 logos are kind of small there's no wildcat on there and then um and then here we have it we basically completed it here so yeah and then uh as far as for the 2024 schedule goes i have no season predictions um, this is the new Big 12 conference out there, and that's a you know you get to look at that. Um, no divisions or anything. So, and this and the scheduling was kind of weird. They kind of it's a little confusing, but it is what it is. But that's the new Big 12, and then this is their schedule for the 2024 season. The red ones are home, white ones are away. Um, so yeah, that's what that looks like. I have no predictions except win every game, guys. Why not? Why not? You guys won 10 last year mostly everyone coming back and then we got i think probably a better coaching staff this year but we'll find out so um 
but yeah that's what everything looks like that's what we're gonna be playing with this year as as far as we know right now but eventually hopefully some point this season or next season we can go to this and i think this looks more complete so been away for a while guys i've been doing working on more stuff we're gonna have, talk about that and um but i wanted to get this out of the way since we're so close to the um, season coming up here and i haven't really talked about um arizona football for a while um but um yeah i'm just happy excited and um let me know what you guys think it's um gonna be i think 12 games that they play so win all 12 guys and uh Let's see what else was I gonna talk about. I wish they changed this Big Twelve logo. It kind of looks like a hugs and kisses, doesn't it? I don't know. It looks like an X and an O, but I don't. We need to change that eventually. So, um, but yeah. Other than that, I think that's all we're gonna talk about in this slide, guys. Um, let me know what you think. Leave comments down below. Uh, we're gonna leave. We're gonna leave this alone for now. Uh, don't know if I'm gonna watch any games this year. I work every day, so uh, we'll see. Though I'm gonna be be watching YouTube for results. So stay tuned, guys, for more. Thanks for watching and uh, bear down.